Welcome to MakeYourMathPop.net. The purpose of this site is to provide students, teachers, and parents supplemental math education materials. You can either use the navigation bar at the top or scroll down to the sides to see that there are math music videos, video lessons and information gap activities, lesson plans, and printable fact sheets. Also, there's a page to help you support MakeYourMathPop.net or you can contact us using this form at the bottom. Let's go ahead and look at the math music videos. As you can see, the math music videos are indexed in alphabetical order here at the top, or you have the option to scroll down and, and browse the videos which are housed on YouTube. If you scroll all the way down to the bottom, there's a link to a website that provides more supplemental materials that are well aligned with the vocabulary used in the math music videos. Let's go ahead and take a look at what that would look like if you click on eighths. eighths into... Moving on to math video lessons and information gap activities, once again, all video lessons are indexed in alphabetical order. This page also has information gap activities, which will be described in another video housed on this page. Information gap activities require two separate downloads, an A version and a B version and is intended for partner work primarily or small group. You can scroll down to the bottom and find more materials. Uh, these are games that go well if you're going to try to add another station in a guided math classroom or just enjoy the games. Let's go ahead and take a real quick look at how one of the video lessons will populate. Here's a multiplication lesson and this is just the introduction. Okay, let's head back to the main site. Following the video lessons page, there is a page for printable worksheets and lesson plans. Ten weeks of lesson plans have been created if you would like to use them in a guided math classroom. So here's an example of one. We've got some objectives, WIDA objectives, Common Core, uh, vocabulary, and a daily breakdown of how you might want to organize this lesson. As you scroll down, there are addition, fact practice sheets, and subtraction, multiplication, and division. I prefer to have fact practice printed out because students can look back and identify patterns and each one of these packets actually has four pages. So here's an example of a subtraction packet, uh, packet E particularly. Skills are repeated and subtraction problems that are typically more difficult for students are repeated more often. Back to our main page. And finally, as we scroll down, we can see some multiplication and division fact practice sheets. The final page of MakeYourMathPop.net is a page of suggestions of how you can support this website if you're so inclined. Some suggestions are to subscribe to Make Your Math Pop's YouTube page, talk about us on Facebook, or follow us, uh, mention us on Twitter. Once again, there's another contact form if you'd like to ask any questions or give feedback. And if you're feeling exceptionally kind, you can donate, which would be used to improve the equipment, and that would help improve the speed and increase the amount of updates we make to the website. Okay, and we're back to the main page, and thank you for taking the time to learn about MakeYourMathPop.net.